Кинуся привіт, чому ти вирішила доєднатися до організації «Справжні» і представ себе трошки звідки? Та й так, хто? я Яна, мені 20, я студентка з Моглянки в Києві. От, а загалом я з Рівного. Я приїхала сюди, бо в Рівному я не почуваюся корисною. В Києві вже дуже багато роботи зроблено, бо той регіон досить давно де окупували. Але в Херсоні дуже потрібні лишні руки. Клас. Тому я тут. По роботи тут дуже багато і дуже необхідна допомога тут. Клас. Особливо з розбиранням завалів, з ліквідацією наслідків підриву ГЕС. От. Тому я тут. Ми дуже тебе за це вдячні. Клас. Чекаємо всіх тут. Все, so, Джон. Um, I have small questions to you. Please int- introduce yourself, who you are, from which country you came, and why you came to support our team Spravzhny in Kherson. Sure. So, my name is John, I'm from Sweden, and uh, I came to Kherson to help uh, my friends, and his friends are you, so I stayed here to help. Cool. Thanks. Um, так, Ernst. У мене та пару питань, будь ласка, представся, звідки да, ти і чому ти приїхав до Херсону? Родом з Херсону, з 2017 року я жив у Запоріжжі, волонтер там. Повернувся до Херсону, тому що не міг стояти осторонь, коли клята на вулиці штурмує мій рідний, моє рідне місто і я хочу допомагати своєму рідному місту. Класно, дуже дякуємо. Тон, Тон, I have some small questions to you. Please introduce yourself, who you are, from which country you came, and why you came to, to Ukraine and to Kherson, yeah, to the team Spravzhny. Um, so my name is uh, Anton. I was born here in Kiev, uh, but I moved to the States when I was four. And uh, recently I had some time off of work, and uh, I decided to come to Ukraine for a few months to volunteer. You know, uh, just watching the news wasn't enough, so I had to, uh, you know, get my hands uh, dirty, as they say. And I came to Kherson because recently, uh, as you know, the dam broke, and there's a lot of flooding and a lot of work to do here, so that's uh, why I'm here. And thank you for that. So, Wally, I have a small question to you. From which country you came, who you are, and why you came to Kherson to support the team Spravzhny? Well, I'm a German. Uh, I'm a volunteer firefighter. I like to help people. That's why I'm here. And I'm looking forward to helping, like I did the last three weeks. It's a good job. And if you can want to help too, get in contact with these people. It's a really nice place to be in. Oh, thank you. <laughs> So, well, I have uh, some questions to you, who you are, from which country you came, and why you came to support Spravzhny team in Kherson. Yeah, I came from Germany, Bavaria. Yeah. I came to support the people here and my friends who work here for some months. And, you know, to provide some assistance to the people who can't leave these situations and who live under these conditions day by day, and maybe to help them a bit. Thanks. Yep. So, Paul, hello. Can you please introduce yourself? Why and when you come to Ukraine to support people? Uh, well, so I'm Paul. I'm from Australia. Uh, when I got to the Ukraine was, I think it was the 8th. Uh, I arrived in the country, so that was, I don't know, like 21 days ago, so three weeks. Uh, and the reason I came here is because I'm a nurse back in Australia and I thought, you know, might as well use my nursing skills on something other than, you know, post-surgery patients and all that sort of stuff. I'll use it, you know, something more important. Uh, doesn't pay as well though here, so we don't, I don't know if I'll go back. <laughs> okay, thank you that you're here. We are proud to hear that. Yeah, <laughs> no worries. I'm always happy to help. Thank you and Slava Ukraine. Uh, how about something Ukraine? Heroem Slava. Heroem Slava. Yeah, I, I still don't know the language. <laughs> yeah, you will learn. <laughs> so, Alban, hello. Uh, please introduce yourself a little bit when you come to Ukraine and why you come to support our people. Uh, uh, so, yeah, my name is uh, Alban. <laughs> uh, I came here like three weeks ago. Um, I honestly don't know what day it is, it's Thursday, so I've been here for a few weeks and one day. Uh, I, I don't know, I wanted to help out because uh, I knew I could uh, 
I had nothing to do back home, so I just thought, you know, why not? And from which city you came of? from? Which country? Uh, Sweden and the, the small city is a very tiny town called uh, Söderham. Cool. Thank you that you're here. So, Julio, hello. Can you please uh, introduce yourself a little bit? Uh, share with us information when you come to Ukraine and when you come to, to support our people. Sure, Dobri <laughs> Dan. Um, this is my third trip from Boston. First trip was um, April 2020 through 2022, Poland and Ukraine border. Second trip was April 2023 in Lviv. And um, there I hope make food for the soldiers in the front line. And this is my third trip for two weeks. Stopped in Kyiv, Pesharki, Pesharki, Kotaki, made some camouflage nets. I knew my main objective was to come here to Sprashny, Ukraine. That was the main thought. And the main reason why I wanted to come here is first is to, I believe you can always have extra hands. And I think my presence here can bring public awareness to the destruction from the Russian invasion, but also bring support continue support after I leave. So that's a big part of it also. Thank you that you are here. Is that helpful? Yeah. Thank you.